Economic developments have been mostly positive and well received by the markets and have exceeded even this optimist's expectations. The only unhappy investors this year have been the Debbie Downers, the Perma Bears, and other pessimists who are convinced that 2023 will be as bad or worse than 2022. Truth be told, I can't recall a happier batch of economic indicators. The economy added 517,000 jobs last month as the employment rate fell to 3.4%, wages and salaries climbing. January's auto sales jumped to 16.2 million units from 13.6 during December, while the services PMI rebounded to 55.2 from 49, signaling expansion. And the housing market may be bottoming as mortgage rates have edged down and home prices are falling. So bottom line, the economic news is not aligned with the Perma Bears narrative 